Some things I never thought I needed Some things I never thought I'd have Cause if they are too hard to believe in The moment I ever call them mine I knew exactly what I was called Exactly what to say There will be nothing to get over If I just let it slip away So I guess I'm proud to say one thing that keeps me motivated in the mornings is listening to music whilst I'm getting ready especially when I'm up early getting ready for the gym I have brushed my teeth done my skincare and put just some kind of basic makeup on use the eyelash curl as you guys would have seen just kind of opens my eyes up a little bit without having to put mascara on a bit of bronzer a bit of blush and I am about to get ready to head to the gym what is the time it is coming up to quarter to seven on the 16th of November. I um, recently got the Aura Ring, the latest one, which is the Aura Ring 4. I have to say, it is a little bit on the expensive side, but I've really been enjoying it lately. And I'm someone that really struggles with sleep. I have constant broken sleep. So I really need to try and work on how to fix that. I just had a look at what my sleep was like last night. I was so tired. I probably fell asleep around half seven yesterday. Got back home from work and I was just knackered. So yesterday's sleep was, just need to clean my screen because it's a little bit day. The total amount of sleep it's saying I had is seven hours and 38 minutes, which isn't too bad. My deep sleep was one hour and 25 minutes, which does not sound a lot at all. My REM sleep, two hours, nine minutes. Restfulness is good. Efficiency, 85%. Total sleep, seven hours, 38 minutes. Latency is in red. <laughs> and if I click on it, it says, sleep latency is the amount of time it takes you to fall asleep at night. Sleep latency is only shown for your longest sleep period. Ideally, you should fall asleep within 15 to 20 minutes of lying down. Falling asleep in less than five minutes can be a sign of overtiredness. If you have trouble falling asleep, try doing something relaxing, ideally in low light, until you feel sleepy again. For some, it can help to get out of bed, but avoid doing something that energizes you. I thought that was a good thing, because I fall asleep really quickly. That's one thing that I'm kind of happy about. I could fall asleep within five minutes because I am that tired and I'm ready to go to sleep. My REM sleep was two hours, nine minutes. It's 28%. And REM sleep is what does it mean? Oh, so REM sleep is associated with dreaming, memory, consolidation, and creativity. REM, rapid eye movement. Sleep plays an important role in energizing your mind and body. REM sleep includes all your sleep, including naps. REM sleep makes you anywhere between five to 50% of your total sleep time. On average, the optimal amount for healthy adults starts from one and a half hours, but slightly decreases with age. So yeah, it's kind of just saying, getting a full night's sleep, sticking to a regular sleep schedule and avoiding caffeine, alcohol or other stimulants in the evenings can increase your chance of getting more REM. So yeah, I just need to kind of play around with the app and try and figure out my sleep patterns because my latency hasn't been good ever since I've had this. I've had this on now for a week. So yeah, there's just some things that I need to to figure out but it's just really interesting and you can track your cycle i've linked it with my apple watch as well so when i go to the gym and stuff it shows up on my app i'm just stepping up my little health and wellness journey guys <laughs> so i've got an exciting parcel to open and i thought we would do it in the bathroom because the lighting is just best at the moment especially because now it's so dark in the mornings the light in my bedroom is awful i have a parcel from honor active 
I'm really excited to open this up. Some new bits, which are from her Soft Motion collection. Let's open the Soft Motion leggings in the color Ballet Pink, you guys. This color is so pretty. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. When I was like on social media, they were saying it's the softest material that Honor Active have so far. And I have to say, it definitely is. They feel buttery soft. They are gonna be so comfortable on. I'm just a little bit curious if they're gonna be see-through. This is what the leggings look like. And then at the back, they say Honor. I don't know if you guys can see that on camera. And then I got the matching sports bra. These came in two different styles, but I preferred this one. I believe the other style was a bit more of like a high coverage. I did get this in a size small and this looks tiny. So I'm not quite sure if, hopefully that is gonna fit, but that looks really small because it doesn't have adjustable straps. I'm a little bit worried that this part isn't gonna be long enough for me. Such a pretty little gym set. And then of course I had to get the, um, the jacket. All my jackets that I've got from Honor Active are cropped. So I was like, let me get this one. It's a bit longer, especially now that it's getting cold outside. And what's new on the jackets is they've added a zip. So now they have pockets because the other ones don't have pockets, which is great. But yeah, I cannot wait to try this little set on and hopefully be wearing it today to the gym. I'm in need for a fresh pair of black leggings. So I picked up the leggings that I got in the pink in the black color. I love this material. This is definitely one of my favorite materials. I have some from Gymshark that feel a little bit like this and they're really old. I just love a fresh gym outfit it just makes me feel good and more confident in the gym and just i'm a little bit addicted to active wear <laughs> at the minute let me try these on let's see if this is what i'm going to be wearing to the gym today by the way i've curled my hair using the ghd one just because after the gym i'm going for breakfast and i just kind of wanted my hair my skincare and a little bit of makeup to be done. So when I get home, I'm gonna have a shower and I don't have to think about my face and my hair. Okay, so I've just gotten dressed and I'm trying to find the best place where, where I can put you to show you guys what it looks like. Let's talk about the sports bra. I was a little bit worried that this was gonna be a bit too small for me, but it actually fits perfectly. I'm not normally a huge fan of the Razorback style sports bras on me personally, but because of how pretty this is and how much I like the front, I'm gonna be keeping it. It's so soft, it's stretchy, really comfortable. It has padding in that you can remove, which I think I might leave in today, but if I was to remove it, I would replace it with nipple covers. You guys, if you don't have nipple covers and you don't like wearing padding, because sometimes the padding just be a bit like, thick, I would highly recommend nipple covers. And then the leggings, I tried the leggings on and you guys, they are a little bit see-through. I honestly want to know the secret to the girls that <laughs> wear the leggings and you don't get the CT, the camel toe. But I've put my camel toe underwear on that I recently got and it has helped. And I don't really think you can see the thong underneath because it's seamless. But I don't mind if you can see it a little bit. Obviously with this color, it's gonna be a struggle to hide that. It, it is what it is. And then let's try the jacket on. <laughs> I'm glad that I got these leggings in black as well because I know that I'll just wear them all the time. If I can do it up, that would be great. <laughs> just get my mic. <laughs> Fits just perfectly. So cute. So yeah, you guys, I'm gonna wear this to the gym. I'm gonna go and take my pre-workout. I need to take the tags off as well before I leave because I feel like I know I'm definitely gonna keep it. It's just a shame with leggings like this, because of the color of them and because of the materials really thin, 
Like it's hard to hide the CT situation. <laughs> Let's go and take some pre-workout because that is one thing that helps me get through a really good workout. <laughs> So I've just gotten back from the gym and I thought that I would just quickly do a review on my new Honor Active gym outfit. The leggings, I think I could have sized down to an extra small. I think these come up a little bit big because they are super stretchy. So if you are looking to purchase the leggings from, is it the Soft Mellow, I believe it's called? I forgot what it's called. Then I would definitely size down. I kept feeling like I had to keep pulling them up as well. I don't feel as though they're as high-waisted as I would like them to be. And because I keep pulling them up, I feel like I get a little bit conscious of the CT, hence why I had the jacket wrapped around me throughout my whole time while I was in the gym. I was just really conscious that you could see my um like underwear through the leggings but maybe i just need to not think and care about that also they are a little bit sheer and you can kind of see my cellulite through the leggings like at the back of my leg but it is what it is so like it's just normal everyone's got it you're lucky if you don't have it but i have quite a lot of it they're just the two kind of things that were playing on my mind but the sports bra absolutely love jacket is really nice as well just nice to have a kind of thin lightweight jacket just to put on overall i do love this like I do love the new collection. Um, I'm just not sure whether I'm gonna return the black leggings that I got because I hate having to keep pulling up leggings. So yeah, that's just something I need to think about. I am needing to have a shower because I am heading for breakfast for 10.30. It's 9.30 now, so I've got about 20 minutes before I have to leave. So I'm gonna have a quick shower, get dressed, and then head to the place where I'm having breakfast. Oh, I um, got my nails done the other day and I got Biab for the first time ever. And I would highly recommend getting it done if you haven't got it done before. Love getting my nails done. There's this feeling that it gives you when you get your nails done, especially my nails, they get so thin and the cuticles get so dry, especially in the winter time. They just look so much better than they did before. So this is your sign, treat yourself to a little self care moment <laughs> and get your nails done. Even though it's quite expensive these days. <laughs>